got a secret you see but it started like any relationship would right Christ you came into my world and surrounded my life and you stimulated my vision so in hindsight I guess you were right you're the definition of light then you showed me what love really looked like and you touched my heart no scalpel or knife and I would look at you with awe and you loved all my flaws you're the fire in my bones for them cold nights you knew I love music you supported the cause with sweet melodies of your voice invading my thoughts and they were perfect like a landing from Dominique Dawes and we celebrated his love with a round of applause but then time went by and I got comfortable I stopped doing the small things. It's like I gave up on you. We used to talk all day. I would cling and run to you. Now I'm sitting here alone, focused on what I want to do. Unaware that you kept me from the cliff like the Huxtable. I reclined on your love like it's adjustable. I wanted you to love me without me loving you because you've got that agape love. It's non-refundable, right? But I want to change like an audible but you remained the same so then i doubted you then someone new came on the scene she showed me some new things she made me rethink what i knew to be valuable she told me that it was all right to compromise and at gray areas where we should live our lives she introduced me to impure intimacy how we climax physically but we'll be dying spiritually simply put this new thing has got me jittery and i'm attracted to the feeling that she brings but y'all ain't feeling me now we're moving back and forth like a ping pong i thought i could control it but lord i was so wrong because i would be around you but my mind was so gone outside of the galaxy space time and protons because i'm attached to this sexual sin with its arm be ambiance as it carries me in I'm spending less time with you, but more time with sin. How come her smile starts to look like a devilish grin? Now that's scary. But on the contrary, I let that sin lay over me like missionary. I hid it under the rug, hoping my adversaries wouldn't come back to haunt me from the cemetery. But I revisited that grave to seek the feelings I craved. I snuggled up in a casket with the sin I buried. I revisited that grave to seek the feelings I craved. I snuggled up in that casket with the sin I buried. I guess I'm a sinner, most definitely. And I swear, Satan, he is after me, so get thee behind me, Satan. That's what I would pray. But I would keep his contact info just in case. What can I say? It's got a hold of me. No puppeteers or joysticks controlling me. He conned me for my soul and left a hole in me. Now he's playing with my life. Put his console in me. But I'm not misleaded. My ailments you treated. My diseases you healed. My enemies you defeated. Lord, I'm sorry. I just want you to believe it. Because I've been so dishonest. Me and my little secret. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for life, health, strength, and deliverance, Lord God. As that you let people come today and release anything that they're carrying in this room with them and lay it at the altar. Lay it at your feet so they are free to worship, free to praise, free to lift up their hands and, and surrender and, God, and say, God, I'm not enough. I need you in my life. Let this tonight be a night of worship. Tonight be a night of deliverance. Tonight be a night of miracles, Lord God. It can happen tonight. Come sit with us. Come sit with us tonight, Lord God. And break some chains tonight in the name of Jesus. Let your presence fill this place. Start speaking to people. Start opening the hearts. I pray for everybody in this building. Everybody in the seat. Everybody standing up and everybody on their way. I pray that you open up their hearts and their minds and their ears so they're able to listen what you have to say and let it penetrate and cause a transformation. Because at the end of the day, we want to be more 
like you. So we give you all praise, all honor, all glory. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.